today is June 13th, 2017. I miss my wife so much, man. You know, it's hard to just, uh, just throw away 18 years. I wish she would have done this the right way and went to marriage council like she said she wanted to do and see a shrink so she could find out what the hell is wrong with her. Yeah. She always tell me it's not me, it's her, it's her, it's her. It hurts. Two things hurts, man, is um, when uh, everybody's saying they can't believe that she's not being charged with attempted murder on me. Well, she intentionally tried to infect me with AIDS, you know? So find out um, her and that officer, well, Deputy Keith from Fairboat, Minnesota, they've been texting all the time and stuff, and um, she tells me that, uh, don't worry, I'm not going to follow on you. What you got against your husband? I haven't broken the laws in the state of Minnesota haven't done nothing whatsoever, you know. But that's cold, though. Conspiracy is straight cold. Conspiracy and obstructed justice. And strong arm robbery with a badge. Because I got robbed by a deputy on May 7th. And I went home and I caught her. And then I asked her, let me get my pills and stuff. They stole $200 from me. $200. She beat the hell out of me too, man. I'm holding on to the banister so she didn't throw me down the stairs again. Punched me, kicked me, bit me on the, on the right shoulder. Everything, man. Everything. But she got away with it. Like always, she got away with it. Ain't no fucking God. Ain't no justice, man. I, I see why a lot of people kill their fucking wives and uh, or their wives kill their husbands. I see this shit now because ain't no fucking justice, man. There ain't no fucking justice. There ain't. Especially when it comes to us men. We get fucked all the time. We literally get fucked by the system all the time. You know. But yeah, I got robbed and telling the motherfucker, how you gonna give my stuff to, to my, my wife, man? She's about to be my ex-wife. Well, it's marriageable property. That's right. That's up to the judge. You ain't no judge and no jury. You just arm robbed me. You strong arm robbed me and took my money. That's what the hell you did, deputy. But he better hope to God I never see him. Because I will beat his motherfucking ass. That's for damn sure. I will beat him down. I will beat him down. And I don't hit no women. But that's funny, though. You know, all the marriage, for 18 years, I never hit her. She has hit me. She has bit me. She has... She has cut me, never hit that woman in 18 years. And all it takes is a lie just to get a man in trouble. That's all it takes. When well, she's supposed to be behind bars, that's where the fuck she's supposed to be at for attempted murder. And they covering up a crime. It's called conspiracy. Conspiracy. That's what it's called, conspiracy. Conspiracy to cover up a crime, a felony at that. Attempted murder. It could be the misdemeanor or a felony. But she intentionally, intentionally tried to infect me with AIDS on January 6th. So that's attempted murder. But she didn't get charged. It hurts. Oh, I love her. Don't get me wrong, I love her. But I think that's the hardest part on us men. You know, well, some of us men that truly love their wives. But she out there having a little fun. She out there dating and everything and going out drinking and stuff again and messing with drugs again. That's so you her normal thing. She's back into that. You know. But uh, I'll see her in court though. So I got a surprise for her and those deputies. That's for damn sure. It's going to be beautiful. 
Peace out.